exactly what you were doing today. This on the call. was a stone wall. Attempt. You owe the people answers. You owe President Trump answers. Because you're not going to do that. Well, that's what I'm saying. Well, you take a left across this plaza. This is exactly what you were doing today this on the call. Was Stonewalling. This attempt. You owe the people answers. You owe President Trump. Trump. I am the granddaughter of Donald Trump. I'm speaking today to share the side of my grandpa that people don't often see. To me, he's just a normal grandpa. He gives us candy and soda when our parents aren't looking. <laughs> he always wants to know how we're doing in school. When I made the high honor roll, he printed it out to show his friends how proud he was of me. I know. He calls me during the middle of the school day to ask how my golf game is going and tells me all about his. <laughs> but then I have to remind him that I'm in school and I'll have to call him back later. <laughs> when we play golf together, if I'm not on his team, he'll try to get inside of my head. I yeah, know. And he's always surprised that I don't let him get to me. But I have to remind him, I'm a Trump too. <laughs> Even when he's going through all of these court cases, he always asks me how I'm doing. He always encourages me to push myself to be the most successful person I can be. Obviously, he sets the bar pretty high, but who knows, maybe one day I'll catch him. On Saturday, I was shocked when I heard that he has been shot, and I just wanted to know if he was okay. It was heartbreaking that someone would do that to another person. A lot of people have put my grandpa through hell, and he's still standing. Grandpa, you are such an inspiration, and I love you. The media makes my grandpa seem like a different person, but I know him for who he is. He's very caring and loving. He truly wants the best for this country, and he will fight every single day to make America great again. Thank you very much.